Is this the same voice actor as J. Jonah Jameson? Go get me some pictures of Spider-Man! Hello everyone, my name is ASDF. Welcome back to Portal with Ray Tracing. Which, I gotta say, it's making this fire look pretty good. I mean, look at this, look. We'll do another comparison. Ready? Everything just looks so dull without it. With it? Without it? Mmm. With it. Yes. So, uh, just, just a reminder of what we have going on. Now, it's darker in the dark spaces with ray tracing. And I've got these really bright lights going on. And I don't like to have my monitor super bright. So, it is, it is actually a little bit hard for me to see in the dark here. Hopefully, you guys can see it okay. But, uh, yeah. What's up, Casey? Welcome in. You like the stream before it started? Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Okay. We've got a wall here that we can get onto, and a wall here. This is the same wall as this. Oh, but they have the paint here. Okay. Well, we made it through, so. All right, where else can we go? We've got there and here. Okay, a little bit disorienting, but that's fine. Can we go up onto the pipe over here? Excuse me! <laughs> this is just a mirage, it doesn't exist. It's just a ray tracing artifact, that lamp isn't real. My life is a lie. Oh my goodness. Alright, no getting on the pipe for us. I just thought it would be fun, you know? Alright, I see that wall up there. I see, okay, the music is changing. Something's going on. I don't know if we should go down. I mean, this is so cool. Look how big this is. This is back when this was like a really big map too. So the cat's names are Archie and Veronica. We call them Archie and Ronnie. Archie's the redhead and Veronica is, I, is brunette a, a cat thing? She's black. She, black cat and orange cat. I guess redhead is not really a cat thing. Um, so, warning this enrichment shaft may contain unsafe quantities of cosmic ray spallation elements. Well, we can't go in anyways. Condemned vitrification order 615 1961. Do not look at, touch, ingest, or engage in conversation with any substances beyond this point. Okay. It's probably fine, right? I mean, it's pro probably okay. Is there anything we can portal onto in there? I'm not seeing anything. We'll probably just climb up over it or something. Oh, I thought for sure. Oh, okay, I see that. Oh, and right behind us. Okay, that's fine. Okay, we're, we're well in the keep off zone. All right, all right, fine. I, I, we have long fall boots. We could just jump, but it won't let us jump. Watch. Oh, it did, never mind. I'm just bad. Yeah, orange tabby. Uh, what's up, Leviathan? Welcome in. The company that makes the lights couldn't afford collision. Yeah, I guess not. Okay, do not enter, keep out. Is there anything we're missing here? I guess not. They couldn't afford collision, but they can afford to keep all these lights running. I mean, don't know about that. All right, keep out. Here we go. We're going in. It is pitch black. Man, can you guys even see anything? It is so dark. This game wasn't designed to be ray traced. They would have to rework it a little bit. You forgot to say hi. It's all good. Hey, coming in with a joke, always welcome. Always welcome. Oh, I guess I haven't interacted with anything until just now. That's a little... That's a little strange. You wish your username was Siri Twitch Discord one? Aww. Uh, you can... Uh, I don't know. Does anyone know how to change it? Does anyone know how to change the username? I remember this part took me a while, too. Oh. Oh, we gotta push them at the same time, huh? No problem. 
Imagine working on this like super secure thing where you're like, nobody could possibly push these two buttons at the same time. And then they invent the portal gun and they're like, ah, maybe we shouldn't have painted this walls with the special portal paint before even inventing the portal gun that made it so that one person can open this massive door. Maybe not, I don't know. All right. That is a massive door though. And there's just a, there's just a stool and a chair. I, can you imagine like you open this massive door and there's just a guy like the, uh, the, the bodyguard from, um, Better Call Saul. Just, just like a grumpy old dude sitting here. Like, like, can I please just sit on this chair? Like, come on, let me on the chair. I just want to sit down. No! He's just sitting on the chair, grumpy old guy sitting here going, No entry. And you're like, but I just opened the big old vault door. And he's just like, sorry, can't let you in there. I'm just like, ah, oh, okay, I guess I'll just go back. We need to rescue GLaDOS though. So I'm pushing past the old guy that's grumpy. We got ourselves a loading screen with new splash windows here. It's kind of exciting. When you know there's a light behind the door because you can see it spilling through the crack in the bottom because of ray tracing. Somebody commented on the first live stream. Is this toxic sludge? I'm thinking best not to fall in there just in case. I'm thinking really best not to dissolve in the sludge at the bottom of the world. Somebody had commented on the first live stream. Oh, not GLaDOS, GLaDOP, that's right. Um, that it was clickbait. And I'm like, okay, it's slightly clickbait to call it RTX, but it is not at all clickbait to call it ray tracing. So I, I agree and disagree at the same time. Oh, I can go in there. Let's go in there. This may just actually be the way to go. I am glad that thing came up that said pull lever because I would not have seen this. Entrance, entrance way. Automated Doors Lobby Testing Lounge. Welcome, gentlemen, to Amateur Science. Astronauts. Oh, Cave Johnson. You're here because we want the best. And you are in it. So, so who is ready, ready to make some science? science? I am. <laughs> now, if you want to get one another on a little bit of a door, so let me introduce myself. I'm Cave Johnson. I own the place. That eager voice you heard is the lovely girl. Is this the same voice actor as J. Jonah Jameson? Go get me some pictures of Spider-Man. Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. She's the backbone of this facility. Pretty as a postcard, too. Sorry, fellas. She's married to science. Married to science. I feel like we would definitely fall through this if, if we were actually standing on it. But you know what? Video game physics, I'll take it. Okay, we definitely need to fly out of something. We can go... Oh, we can go through... We can go through the donut. We're going through the donut. I don't know if that's what we're supposed to do, but oh baby, we're going through the donut. Oh, that was what we we're supposed to do. <laughs> We've done it again. Where are the speakers? Great. Your test assignment will vary depending on the manner in which you have been Welcome to test subjects. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today. Oh, Cave Johnson the in the flesh, the sort of. Those of you who Click your profile picture, manage. Ah, it is the I've same voice news actor. News That's news. amazing. I love is, this game even more now. Good news is, we've got a much better test for you. Fighting an army of mantis men. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. And give me pictures of that menace while you're at it. Okay. All right, uh, no more Spider-Man jokes. <laughs> There's gonna be more Spider-Man jokes. Every time Cave Johnson speaks, it's give me pictures of Spider-Man. <laughs> and then it changes your name on everything Google. Mm. Yeah, whenever Google acquires something, it's a few years before they integrate. So what if we, oh, it's okay. We'll push the super colliding super button to go up on the lift. I bet we can get squished under this too. I'm not gonna try it. 
I know I usually try to die to see if you can actually die in the game and everything, other than by falling into Toxic Sludge, since fall damage isn't a thing. But then we'd have to go on the whole lift all over again. Ah, oh, we definitely could have gotten out on that level. Maybe we should have. Okay. We pro probably don't need to go over there. There's a door there. There's a way to get up there. And there's a portal thing here. Oh. Uh, maybe we'll aim a little to the left there. <laughs> we just fall out straight into whatever's underneath there. Okay. Do we need... Okay. We need to go like this. And then... We need to go... Back over there, maybe? Um... Well, I guess we could see that from here. I don't know why we needed to, to do that. Where is a space that we can go? Well, there's one under the lift. Oh, we need to go like this. Wait. We need to call the lift down. Can I get off of this, please? Oh, there's stairs. Okay. We just need to jump from the next level down. I, I was like, we need to call the lift, and then while we're calling the lift, we need to do the other thing, but we just need to do this. Pretty sure. Wee. Oh, barely. We made it. It's fine. Push. And we push. Okay. You have to use the push bar, not just push. Yes. Casey is pink ninja. She is my wife. She has been outed due to the Google overlords who have decided that her real name is attached to her Google account and they make it difficult to change. And since she almost caught the house on fire, she decided to just reveal her name to the world. Our microwave's toast, by the way. I think I mentioned it on, uh... Wednesday. Alright, what are we up to this time? There? That's probably a good place to put it. Then we can at least see what's going on over here. Can we jump off? Yeah, we could do it. Okay, maybe we shouldn't have jumped off there, though. Okay. Where are we going? What is happening here? So we can go... around? I'm not sure where we need to be going. We got in here. Maybe downstairs? So, um, now that you stream on YouTube, you can stream Beat Saber without getting your channel deleted. Oh, because of the DMCA stuff? That's good. When is Beat Saber 1v1 with Leviathan gonna happen? I don't know. You would destroy me. My have once played Expert Plus Beat Saber skills. Oh, it's just right here? Wait. Yeah, it's just right here. Okay. I imagine it's a platforming skill game of follow the pipe and don't they fall say off. Great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No handholding. All of it from scratch, but I mean, like you're using elevators. I don't think Aperture invented the elevator. You know, like you're using electricity. I don't think Aperture invented electricity, so you're kind of standing on the shoulders of giants. Not to disagree with J. Jonah J. I mean, Cave Johnson. You right, are here. Started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group. Is it like, way. does it just smell gross? Yeah. It's Last repulsive? Gun got blue paint. <laughs> they invented the aperture All elevator? Alright. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. Uh, repulsion gel was aperture's first attempt to create a di dietetic pudding substitute. Um, it's true, the gel is a sweeter, slightly less non-toxic form of fiberglass insulation that causes subsequently ingested food items to bounce off the lining of a dieter's distended stomach and out of his or her mouth. That is disgusting. For various reasons, this product was pulled from the shelf. So you eat it, it coats the inside of your stomach, and then anything you eat bounces around inside of you until it comes out one way or another. That's, uh, I, I am very glad. Alright, we'll use the gel. 
Oh, it looks really cool too with the reflection. Okay, how much of this is ray traced reflections in the gel surface and how much isn't? I gotta know. All right, you guys ready? Some of it is regular reflection. Some. Did I just spawn that by pressing M? Excuse me? Could I have just spawned a cube by pressing M this whole time? Hang on. Hang on. What the heck? How, how is this a thing? Okay. You, you go in there. You, you guys could be each other's companion cubes. We're going to ignore the fact that that's a thing. <laughs> and we're just going to move on. Wait. I need to press the super colliding super button to open the exit. But there's no... Is there a cube that... Excuse me? Like... Uh, okay, hang on one second. We're gonna jump across here, because we're probably supposed to jump across. We're gonna push the button to get a regular old cube to come down. How confusing is this? What in the world? Oh, you know what? This is probably an old version of just a button, not the super colliding super button. So, okay, well that... Uh, with this the newfound knowledge that, that we always have companions. The group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded messages. I pay the bills here. I can talk about the control group all damn day. Hey, wait a minute. Watch your profanity. Okay, so we can't jump down there because we need some repulsion gel. Next chest test chamber is next chest chamber is this way. We just need any portable surface. How about that? I love Portal 2 because it... We're going in the office? I love Portal 2 because it involves more than just portals, so you almost forget that you have a portal gun after a while, and then you're like, oh yeah, portals. That's probably the solution. Oh, can I just jump? No, we just came from there, and we're headed over here, so we just need to walk over and jump down. Sometimes the best answer is the simple one. And I think... Do we well, go this way? Test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules... Oh, that's where we started. ...into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, uh, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, oh, no. we took care of that too. That's why it wouldn't let us sit on the chair once we opened the thing. It was stopping us from getting cancerous tumors. Cause I don't I don't think I'm wearing lead underwear. I I definitely don't remember putting any of that on this morning. Okay. You could just jump really high off of that. I didn't even know. I want some of this in real life. Along with some long fall boots. Okay. So we need to go over there, probably. We need to get up there though. How do we get up there? Okay, there's a button here that opens a portal there. Can we portal onto this? No. Okay. Hmm. Oh, we can jump out of the portal here and get higher. Oh, except that's in the way. All right, all right, all right. Calm it down. Uh, you're gonna get off a couple minutes. It says something in Portal 2. All right. How does it help us that we can jump just this high now, though? Oh, there's portals up there. We could have... <laughs> Guys, I'm not smart. I say it all the time, but sometimes people don't believe me. I really, I am not smart. Like, I didn't wait for the thing. Kind of not smart, you know? Telling you. Telling you. I like that there's just exposed plywood here, too. Okay. We got the cube. Now we need to get the cube over to here. Which means we need to jump off of the repulsion gel, which smells so gross it repulses anything. We need to jump out here. Huh. Okay. I didn't actually jump, but I think it's fine. And then... We need to get this cube somehow, which is probably just jump back and forth. I love these puzzles, man. I, I love Portal 2's puzzles. 
Oh, what's, wait, what's down there? Hang on. Is it just death? We can make that jump. We could totally make that jump. Wait, but that's where we came from, I bet. I bet that's where we came from. Yeah, it's totally where we came from. Okay. Okay, now we got this one. And then we'll uh, do this one. Boing! And we missed. Okay, we just gotta go forward and then hit the edge, right? Yeah, that's that's the way. Levi's, uh, JJ's gonna come back and be like, Turn it up. Pressing M is unique to ASDF. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. So probably don't ingest it as pudding. Good to know. Sometimes don't assume something is diet versions of pudding. If you're like, what is this repulsive substance? Have you tried eating it? Oh, it kills you. It hates human skeletons. No big deal. Who needs bones anyway? All these anyways? are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping. Because that's not part of the test. That's okay. Asbestos. That's Good great. The news is the lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of canasta. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by three centuries. Okay. Uh, well, there's one up here. I don't know how that helps me, though. Let's let's look around a bit. There's gel flow up that... Oh, here we go. That's where we need to go. Then we can go like this. And then just... We can just come through here. It's fine. We got long fall boots. I like your style. You make up your own rules, just like me. Oh, because the entrance is blocked? Oh, okay. Interesting. So we can put the repulsion gel anywhere we want. Which means... Let's go this way. Oh, I've been covered in repulsion gel. I'm gonna die. It's fine. I put the wrong portal there. That's not ideal. Where's that thing? It was up here, and then like this, and then we go like this. Oh, it just keeps coming. We don't have to push the button. Well, let's just throw it everywhere then. We're gonna we're gonna make everything repulsive. Oh, my head! Okay, we'll get more gel. I'm just gonna get it as, in, in as many places as I possibly can, because we'll probably need it in as many places as we could possibly have it. As the exit is up there, then we definitely need to jump, like, this way. But I don't know if we have enough repulsion gel to actually get us to the exit. Definitely not enough. So where do we need to jump from? Okay, stop moving. Are we still moving? Okay. Where do we need to go from to get to the exit? Excuse me. We need to jump from as high as we've already been. Okay, so let's go back up this way. And we'll see where we can go. Maybe there's other spots in here that we can get to. Oh, yeah, there's a whole testing chamber in here. <laughs> Telling you guys. Not smart. This guy right here? Not smart. Okay, now we need to put it there. Ah, we've been covered in it again. Okay. Then... We need to add some repulsion gel. Will it get will it get burned up, you think? It makes it through the disintegration chamber. 
How is that even possible? Well, that was much easier than I made it out to be. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. That's fine, I need more bones anyways. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. Don't think about how your frontal lobe is calcifying. And then you're fine. It won't calcify. It's like it's like the people that say you gotta speak things into being, except it turns your brain into bones. Now, if you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're going to need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh, I bet, I bet. Okay, hang on one second. How do we get it on there? How do, did we get slightly higher the longer we were bouncing on it? Okay, this needs testing. I'm just trying, yes, your next bounce is higher than the last. Which means if we get it here. Then we go there. Oh, and then we just jump up here. That wasn't so bad. I'm telling them, keep your pants on. You tried right, to use no clip on this level, but it didn't work. Oh, interesting. So, word of advice. If you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time. Entirely. Forward and backward. So, do both of yourself It'll just favor, wipe just out let time? Let devil go about his business. Okay. Well, we have blue stuff in all the places we might need it. We don't have it there. We can put it on the floor, though. I think. Yeah. Okay, how are we gonna do this? Probably a portal here, and a portal there. And then we go like this. Maybe we, uh, maybe at first we go like this. And then we put the portal here because that makes more sense. Okay, apparently that's not it. Let's try this on for size. Start up here. Then we go like this and then like this. Yeah, that feels better. Ooh, white gel flow. And blue gel flow. Okay, we probably just need to find a spot to portal. Like, up there. Uh, that's not gonna be the spot. Almost can guarantee you that's not where we need to put that portal. So, what's up, Tim? Welcome. You made, Is this an automated lift situation? Or is this a just jump because you'll be fine situation? I have a feeling we need blue goo um, but you know what we'll just jump it'll be fine we'll go here and uh, there okay and then now that we're here we can just jump now we have that spot so we can always get back I don't know what to do here. I feel like I'm missing something big. I was definitely missing something big. All right, but okay. That's a thing. Uh, this one? Ah, the other one. You came in a little late. Ah, it's all good. Glad you could be here. Hopefully you enjoy. That's all we needed, I think. Now we can just do this. Boing. Made it. Okay. I'm not going to just try to coat everything because it just takes forever. And if you don't need it, then why did, why did I need this here? 
This, see, this is one of those simple puzzles that, like, you just forget that you have a portal gun. Nah, I ain't afraid of you. It's so sad you had to go to dinner. What kind of dinner? Like, I love going to dinner. Dinner's amazing. Oh, I remember this one. I don't remember a lot of them, but I remember this one. I love this one. And that is what'll happen to us if, if we get covered in this stuff. Or something like that, you know? Yeah, go clean yourself off, Cube. Mr. Cube, come here, come here, come here. You need a bath. It's time to bath. JCWS you went to? Oh, I don't know what that is. Maybe it's a regional thing? We don't have a lot of restaurants in uh, in SoCal that have um, names. JC, JCSs? Yeah, we the only one that we have here that goes by letters is like, we got BJs. We got, um, okay, we just need it to come out here, right? So then, then we'll just jump. Does it automatically go? Oh, and then we can cover the cube and then it'll bounce and then we're good. Okay. Well, I like this guy. JCWs. Yes, you box your stuff. What'd you have? Parking lot, car, goodbye. We get to go hang out with some friends for dinner. We're on, uh, we're on part of the music ministry at our church, and every now and then we all get together and have dinner, and it's a great time. Congratulations! The simple fact that you're standing here listening to me means you've made oh, a look glorious at that contribution to science. Wow. As founder and CEO of Aperture Science, I thank you for your participation and hope we can count on you for another round of tests. Sure. Hey, watch your profanity, Mr. J. Jonah, I mean, Cave Johnson. Say goodbye, Carolyn. Goodbye, Carolyn. She is a gem. What are we doing here? What's what's happening? Why why are we we have a portalable surface there? I don't know where else we do though. Maybe it's like way out. Way out and way up. Yeah, that seems about right. Oh yeah, because normally we'd be done with testing, but we're just going to proceed on to another round. If I don't mind if I do some more testing, just for fun. Got myself a portal gun. I I don't know if they... They have to have had these test chambers available for portal gun users. So they've had the portal gun tech since like the 50s? Oh, a fast food place. Got it, got it. Giant, uh, giant chicken strips. I, I am a fan of the chicken strip. Honestly, I could go for some chicken strips right now. That sounds great. Okay, we do this. And then we... We need to put a portal over there, though. How do we put a portal over there while we have a portal up here? That's the question. Oh, you know what? We just have to be smarter than the test. Okay. Mm hmm Oh, wrong one. I'm not smarter than the test. Yeah, we got Chick-fil-A. Your cats are so cute. Thank you. Okay, we jump in. We fire the orange portal straight ahead of us. And then we win the game. We just won the game. Let's go. All right, now none of y'all need to play the game anymore. 
Um, gel pressure control and gel pressure control. Okay, we turn the blue gel on. And we turn the orange gel on, whatever that does. Here we go. Maybe it's the the opposite of repulsion gel. Although the long fall boots are kind of the opposite of repulsion gel, so I don't know. Okay, we got ourselves a mover moving Greetings, platform. Friend. I'm Cave Johnson, CEO of Aperture Science. Yeah, you, we, you we know. You as a vital participant in the 1968 the Senate hearings on missing astronauts. And you've most likely used one of the many products we invented, but that other people have somehow managed to steal from us. That's how Black it works. Mesa can eat my bankrupt... Sir, the testing? Black Mesa. You might be asking yourself, Cave, just how difficult are these tests? What was in that phone book of a contract I signed? Am I in danger? Let me answer those questions with a question. Who wants to make sixty dollars? I do. You can also feel free to relax for up to twenty minutes in the waiting room, which is a damn sight more comfortable than the park hey. bench that most of you were sleeping on when we found you. Watch your profanity, so, Mr. Cave Johnson. You're here because we want the best, and you're it. Nope. Good okay. Straight face. Do anyway, we fly? Don't the glass down there. In fact, why don't you just go ahead and not touch anything unless it's test related? Oh, wait, that's the control room. So let's let's go there first. Cause I think we can get on that platform. Oh, I missed. Oh, I missed. It's fine. Everything's fine. It's it's okay. That what just happened? How did I mess that one up? Okay, blue goes there. We step through. Orange goes there. Blue goes there. And then we jump. Can you tell me a hint about this part? It's like a spoiler. Um, no, if I get stuck, then maybe. It's glad up! Let's go! Did you feel that? That idiot doesn't know what he's doing up there. This whole place is going to explode in a few hours if somebody doesn't disconnect him. I can't move, and unless you're planning to saw your own head off and wedge it into my old body, you're going to need me to replace him. Alright. So what do you say? You carry me up to him and put me back into my body, and I stop us from blowing up and let you go. Okay, but I fully expect that you're gonna- You stabbed me. What is wrong with you? We stuck it right onto the portal gun. Never mind. The gun must be part magnesium. It feels like I'm outputting an extra half a volt. Keep an eye on me. I'm going to do some scheming. Here I go. No scheming for you, Gladop. What happened? That thing moved. An extra half volt helps, but it isn't going to power miracles. I think we just need to, um, do this. I don't think we need to do anything fancy here. Yeah, we just need to, um, go backwards. Just a little bit. Nope. No, nope, we messed it all up. Okay, guess we're gonna fly at it then. That's fine. Glad up, potato. Ow! Did you guys hear my nose just break? Cause I heard it. You made a nickname? Yeah. We got GLaDOP here. Oh, I like GLaDOP better than GLaDOS. Because GLaDOS tries to kill us and GLaDOP is just a potato. <laughs> so. The testing area is just up ahead. The quicker you get through, the quicker you'll get your 60 bucks. Great. Carolyn, are the compensation vouchers ready? Yes, yes sir, Mr. Johnson. Boy, did I just... Who is oh. that? What the hell is going on here? GLaDOS. Not Potato GLaDOP. GLaDOS was modeled after Caroline. She just involuntarily responded. Cave Johnson. Oh, I remember what the orange stuff does. Okay, I'm not going to spoil it. I remember now. This is awesome stuff, though. And we're just going to... Uh, we're just going to throw it over here. Yes. Okay. Oh, oh yeah. I don't even think we need the ramp to go any higher. I think we just, I think we can just go. You played this not long ago? Alright, you guys ready? I did not even jump. Let's go. Okay, we probably need... That was really disorienting. We probably need some more of it in here. 
Because why not? Actually, um, hang on. Before we do anything crazy. You know, there were... The le We don't talk about this. We don't- we don't talk about this. I am not a smart man. Yeah, thank you me from the past. Okay, well, we need super speed here, which I thought we did. Um, we apparently still do. So we need to figure out how to get it to go here. And still get up there. To push the button. I think what we have to do is drop down here. We need to push the button, then run on the stuff, and then make a portal that goes... No, that's that takes way too long. That can't be the solution. We need to... What do we do here? What do we do here? Because we need a button for that. You killed Gladop. Okay, we still have this here, and there. We just need to be able to push the button. But we need to be able to shoot a portal to get up there. Oh, uh... We just put the blue portal up there. I'm thinking now, I'm thinking. I forgot how to think with portals. Then we put the blue one there, and then we put the orange one there. And then we just jump straight into here, with the goop. Because, why not? Might as well. And then we get ourselves a cube. I think I did the wrong one. It's fine. Because we can still see that one from here. And then we just go like this. Huh? Huh? Hey, hope Gladop doesn't get eaten. Drop this cube on the non-super colliding super button. And we will head out. I jumped that time. Hey, wait a minute. I jumped that time. Hold on a second. Maybe I'm not supposed to jump. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. We gotta... We gotta go... Fast. Which means... We need this blue portal... Here. So that we can go really fast. Right? We'll jump. Yeah. Yeah. What does this button do? How do we get up here? Oh, we just jump. Oh, not like that. Oh, yes, like that. I think, right? Something like that. Hey! All right. Do not leave your belongings here, loiter for more than twenty minutes, or touch the glass. Do wear a shirt and shoes at all times. Move quickly through your test track, and do not forget to touch the glass. That made me think of dumb ways to die. Yes. <laughs> what does this button do? We can go up here, though. Remember, if you see an orange jumpsuit, hit the red button. But we're wearing an orange jumpsuit. Remember, alert your supervisor if you see OSHA inspector, Department of Energy inspector, GAO accountant, undercover police officer, nuclear regulatory commissioner, FEMA coordinator, ordinary police officer, journalist, public works inspector, MSHA mine inspector, ATF, FBI, or US marshal. That $60, buy a whole yacht and a spiffy suit. Whoa, what happened? I know where those last two cameras are in Portal 1. Oh, got it, got it. Yeah. Okay, you don't have to spam the... <laughs> you don't have to spam the chat. Um, yeah, yeah. Although, I don't know which ones I missed. So... Hard to know. We just came from here, right? And then we're going this way? Hmm... What does this do? Okay, we got some blue goo, and we got some orange goo. So what do we need to do with the blue and orange goo? Okay, we've got a target there that's orange. So what if I just... do a little bit of this? Oh, what's up, Keely? 
A ninja coming on in here. Do I also play Half-Life? Yeah, I, you know, I played it before I uploaded the VODs. I used to stream on Twitch. So, I never responded to it. I, I was curious because I thought you were saying cameras in, in Portal 2, but yeah, misread it. Um, so we need to coat this whole thing with orange to get fast enough and then blue right at the end. So, how do we coat this whole thing with orange? If we put it there and there. Um, I played Half-Life before it was a VOD. Yeah, that worked well. Then we put blue on the end here. Um, and then I played Black Mesa. So I might play Half-Life again. Maybe I'll just add ray tracing to the original Half-Life. <laughs> Cause that just, that sounds hilarious to be honest. Okay, so we need to get back. Um, we'll just do it there. Oh, it auto jumps when you're going fast. Actually, we don't, we can't have that there yet. Um, it's fine. Your comments come late. Yeah, there's there's a little bit of uh, of delay there, which is okay. So um, we have one there, which I think all we need to do is put one there and there. So we'll put the orange anywhere. What's up there though? Can we get up there? I don't think so. Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm not thinking so. I was gonna play uh, Half Life Two next. But maybe it would make more sense to play Half-Life 1 again on YouTube, so there's some continuity. Oh. Hmm. Oh, there's one up there. That. I'm telling you guys, it's like I forget how this game works. I think we just need to fly out of there. Yeah, pretty sure. Or... Do I just need to put this here, and then I'll just jump down and then back up and then fly out? Nope, that's death. That's how you die! Yeah. Sometimes I take forever, because I'm like, doing a thing, and I don't always want to stop in the middle of my train of thought. Um... Death. Sometimes they come through late, sometimes it takes me a, a while to respond. It's a little bit of both. And I, and I think it's mostly selfish <laughs> because it takes me a lot longer to edit the videos when I'm constantly pausing. Um, so I, I try my best. It's Man, streaming is still hard for me. It's still hard, so it's hard to catch them all. Missed. I, I, I missed. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to do exactly that, Keely. <laughs> I just... I'm just not good at video games. <laughs> okay, let's put it there. Alright, here we go again. Let's try this thing. Alright, here, blue, we're going straight for it. Hey! Yeah, that does it. I'm pretty sure I just started out homeless. That's... That's, that's it. So... Hey, listen up down there. That thing's called an elevator. Not a bathroom. Hey. Listen up, it's a bathroom if I make it a bathroom, okay? Maybe GLaDOS is actually the singularity. They uploaded... Was it Caroline? They uploaded Caroline's consciousness into a computer that then got uploaded into a potato. So if now Caroline is a potato. $60, flag down a test associate and let him know. You could walk out of here with 120 weighing down your bindle if you let us take you apart, put some science stuff in you, and then put you back together. Good as new. Um, okay. Wait, spoiling the whole game for you? How am I spoiling the whole game? I'm playing it. I try so hard not to spoil ahead of time. All right, we got a cube up here that we need to get with a hatch in case we drop it. I don't know what's past there. Let's go, let's go ex explore a little bit. Okay, there's nothing past here. There's a big old nothing. Okay, we've got a little, we've got a button down there. Let's see what that does. Turns that upwards. So we probably need to spray that with something. Oh, okay. Um, can we still hit this? We need to spray this with, I'm assuming, the blue goo before we turn it. And we need to put the orange portal to do that. 
So we... Oh, you haven't played the whole game yet, but you want to? Well, hopefully it's okay. Hopefully watching me play it and playing it yourself are, uh, are similar, similar feel. Okay, that's good for us. I'm pretty sure, because we can get to there now. I'm gonna go play Rainwell? All right, Levi. Have fun and enjoy. Okay, so we can go real fast out of there. We can go real fast. Oh no, I was gonna say we can go real fast here, but this is a platform that we can't go fast on. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> oh. I'm dying. It's fine. Everything's fine. I just can't human anymore. <coughs> uh, what is wrong? Okay. Let's see what it looks like from here. Interesting lighting. Don't die on stream. I will try not to die on stream. Okay, we need blue goo to come out there. So we'll do blue... Nope. We still need orange goo here. Let's let's put the blue goo there. Yes, and then let's put some orange goo... Here. Well, it didn't say not to get covered in orange goop. That's probably fine. Now we're super fast all the time. Okay, so then we run at that. Oh no! Okay, we stopped it just in time. We run at that, bounce off of that, land somewhere. Hopefully it's where that cube is. All right, here we go. One, two, three. We are so smart. That didn't sound good. Whatever, it's fine. Okay, now we need to get this over to there. And put it on here. We get the blue goo. And that, I don't know how that helps us actually. How does it help us to turn that upwards? Because what launches us out onto here? Hmm. Okay, well let's go back over this way. We can get up there. We can launch up there. Oh, oh, okay. So we need blue goo over there. I didn't even see that. Okay, there's blue goo on that one. Now we got that going. So I think all we need to do then is head over this way. We need to put a portal here and here, and then I think we should just be able to launch it. Have I played it with two players? I, yes. Long time ago, I played through it two player. I'm a big fan of single player games though. Disassemble you. We're not banging rocks together here. We know how to put a man back together. So that's a complete reassembly. New vitals. Not mean to click. Spit shine on the old ones. Plus, we're scooping out tumors. Frankly, you ought to be paying us. Um, yeah, I'd like my tumors removed, please. You didn't tell me about the lead-lined underwear thing until it was too late. So, when you finish the game, we should play together. That's tricky. That's tricky. Um, while I very much would enjoy thank playing you. through Portal 2 on stream, because there's some continuity. Um, it is very difficult to schedule with other people. And for that, humanity is grateful. If you had any belongings, please pick them up now. We don't want old newspapers and sticks cluttering up the building. Hey, just because I'm homeless you doesn't you mean I have old newspapers and sticks. I have so current newspapers on, and broken bicycles. Hats, beard, dirt. I do like tattered hats and beard dirt. Not really. That, that sounds like two unenjoyable things here. Okay, we got something there. We got something. Thank you for not loitering longer than 20 minutes. Excuse me, I'm still dying just a little bit. All forms must be filled out legibly and completely before eligible to receive payment of $60. Something was taped over and $60 was done. Um, you get that, but if we ever played, I'm up for any time. The, the tricky part is that it's a long playthrough, so it would be several streams. Um, and yeah, so I, I totally get it. I'll have to think about it. I'll have to think about it because I can't promise like I can't promise the community to do something and expect that someone else is gonna be as serious about it as I am because like it's 
my channel that I'm growing and everything, you know? So, but then I don't want to make someone else have to commit as well. So if we ever did, as long as it isn't like Saturday at 11 a.m. Eastern through 1 p.m. Eastern, it should be fine. Yeah. Um, okay, we can go, we can go this way. And we can go up there. Wow, I'm glad that they just painted all these random walkways with portable surface paint. Copy it on Google. Um, I have links disabled. Yeah, take all the time you need, GLaDOS. I, I got you. So, yeah, I have links disabled in, uh, in live stream. But if you want to join the Discord, I, I know we've we mentioned it before. Ooh, white pressure. Oh, we're getting all these pressures going. Oh, they're just spraying everywhere. Oh, no. Now we have this to worry about. Which actually, I, I refuse to do. Yes. I refuse to do platforming challenges because I'm terrible at them. Wait, we didn't have to use the orange gel. Oh, there was no orange gel. Okay, that's, that's fine. Oh, here's the orange gel. Um, well, I guess you can't refuse forever. My new boss is a robot, but did you know robots are smarter than you? Robots work harder than you, and robots are better than you. What's my Discord server called? Um, I need to set up my custom commands to drop the Discord link. It's called the Keyboard Mashers. Uh, and it's actually, I think it's in the description. If you open up the, uh, the description of the live stream, it should be in there. Okay. Blue is here, and orange is here. That, excuse me. That was probably a little too close for comfort. Welcome to the enrichment center. Oh, Cave Johnson, you sound like you've got one too many tumors. Mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, has not. Mm -hmm. As a result, you may have heard we're going to phase out human testing. There's still a few things left to wrap up, though. Oh, he looks old. The bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy seven dollars worth of moon rocks, much less seventy million. Bought them anyway. Ground them up, mixed them into a gel. Moon rock right. gel. Ground up moon rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now, we're going to see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leach the lunar poison out of a man's bloodstream. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. <coughs> lunar rock dust gel. That said, um. I would really appreciate it if you could test as fast as possible. Carolyn, please bring me more pain pills. Boy, poor Cave Johnson. When science goes too far... Um, well, I'll push a red button. I don't know what it does, but robots don't sleep. Volunteer for testing today. Is it just, what, it, did it open the door maybe? I don't know. Um, but Tim, see you later. Thanks for coming on. Bye. Aperture Science, let's work together. Is that the NPC face meme? Is that the meme? I don't think it came from Portal 2, but I'm pretty sure that's the NPC guy. Wow, that's exciting. I did not expect to see that meme here in Portal 2. And again, this is not a, an official RTX remake of Portal 2. That guy's face was on that poster long before the NPC meme was a thing. So please do not test if you're allergic to lunar sediment and or starch. You have fulfilled your monthly test self-election quota, or you are competent enough in your work performance to unvolunteer from test self-election process. I'm not confident enough in my work performance to do that. That light flickered when we bashed our head on it. But at least we didn't phase through it like the last one we tried to jump on. So, all right, I think that's where we got to call the stream. We found out, we found out about the moon rocks, which is exciting. And Cave Johnson just does not seem like he's doing that great. So this is a long elevator ride for no loading screen. And I like that the dates seem to be ascending. So we're, we're in the 80s now. And uh, this is where we're going to call it. We'll pick it back up on Monday. And yeah, that does it for today. So thank you guys for coming by. As always, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and or weekend. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.